go ahead and get started. Hey, everybody. All right, let's get started. I'm trying to figure out. This is my first time going live on... It's my first time going live on Amazon, but I'm going to try to do both. I'm going to be live on, on YouTube as well as on Amazon, and I think I might even try to add Instagram on here if I can. If I can, not a hundred percent sure I can. All right, so thank you guys for coming in on the live. I am live on Amazon, which is where you'll be able to get all the links and everything. So I do have the Amazon link in the description box for YouTube. So I um, I would love for somebody to put the link in the chat, but I'm not sure I can figure out how I can put the link in the chat. Um, I don't think I can put the link in the chat, but it's all good. If I figure it out, I will put the link in the chat. Or if you guys figure it out, put it in the chat for me. So let's get started. Hi guys, this is my first time going live on Amazon. I'm Jess Monique Thomas. I do have a platform on YouTube, Instagram, and um, Instagram and um, Amazon. So I just wanted to come on here and share with you guys some of my beauty favorites from Amazon. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first item I want to share is my tried and true item. This is my Yellow Bird from Con Air. It's my favorite blow dryer. This blow dryer gets the hottest as well as um, the most powerful. Like it's it, the the airflow is very powerful. So this blow dryer, um, I've been using the Con Air yellow bird since my daughter before my daughter was born so i've been using it for over 14 years um during that time i've only had to repurchase this blow dryer two times so i had one before this and then i had this one so in 14 years i only had to buy two yellow birds they're 59 dollars, very affordable and i just love this blow dryer it comes with this comb piece and a hose piece it it, it gets hot Okay, like this is going to give you the best press out. I always say the best press out starts with the best blow dryer. So this blow dryer is literally going to get your hair super straight, super fast. And I just love that about the um, yellow bird. So highly, highly recommend this blow dryer. It's a tried and true item that I use in my home all the time. And the comb lasts. The comb lasts a very long time, which I really love. But um, the most thing I love about this is how hot it gets. It really straightens your hair really fast. And everybody on YouTube, y'all already know about this blow dryer. Um, it's by Conair. It's extremely affordable for it to be so good and to get so hot. Um, and to last as long as it does and it's only $59 and a lot of times you can get it even cheaper than that So highly recommend this blow dryer Let me see if I can get Started on Instagram Hopefully the Instagram will get started so the next product, hey, you guys, I'm just sharing my favorite beauty products with you guys on this live. Um, I am live on Amazon, which is where you're going to be able to see all the items that I've chosen today. I will leave a link to the live in the chat. So definitely check the chat if you want to watch on Amazon live, because that is where all the links to the products will be as as I go down the list. So the next item that I want to share with you guys, a beauty favorite of mine that I've been using for years and years is the Ebon Lace Tint Spray. Um, I've been using this one and the color that I use is medium dark brown. That one matches my skin tone perfectly. It, it 
um, tints your lace for your wigs and allows your wigs to really, really blend with your skin tone. They have several different skin tones, so you don't have to get the medium dark brown. But if you're my shade, this is the one that works best for me. I highly, highly recommend this one. And like I said, you can get it on Amazon. It's $7.59. It's on sale right now, 30% off. So definitely make sure you head over to my um, Amazon and check this out. Next product I want to share with you guys is my favorite, favorite brush. And it comes in a set. This is the brush that I use. Oh, and of course, it has some hair in it because I use this brush all the time. This is the brush, it's, it's, I always call it the scrape your brain brush. <laughs> this is the brush you need when you want to do a sleek ponytail, okay? This is the scrape your brain brush. <laughs> everyone from their childhood, I feel like everyone's mom had a brush like this that literally just scrapes your entire brain off. Um, but this brush will get your hair and your ponytail super laid. Obviously, I did not use it for this ponytail because this ponytail is not laid at all. But if you want your ponytail laid, you get your gel, your jam, whatever you need, and you grab this brush. Now, this um comes in a set on Amazon for $5.99. You get this brush. You get this rat tail comb. You get this brush. You get this rat tail comb. And you get a baby hair um a baby hair brush for $5.99. Great price. Um, and it's the only way that I've been able to purchase this brush over and over again. Hey, Ray. Um, this is the only way that I've been able to purchase this brush over and over again. You can't just buy this brush on its own. You actually have to buy it in the set and the set is $5.99. Totally worth it. You have to have one of these brushes if you like sleek, slick ponytails, which I absolutely love. Um, again, this is not a sleek ponytail, but if it was, I would have grabbed this bad boy and snatched my, my, snatched my brain out. Um, cause that's exactly what this brush does. Sorry. I have a braid in the back of my head that's trying to show. So highly recommend this brush. Next thing I really recommend for, um, hair care, um, is the super grow this is old school y'all this is by Bronner brothers this is extremely old school but if you know you know this hair grease will keep your hair moisturized and will very much so help your hair to grow it has a lot of vitamins a lot of um good things in it for your hair and mostly it just helps to keep your hair um, moisturized. I love this. I have so many of these containers of grease. It's just, it reminds me of my childhood too. Like, I just love using this um, hair grease. So I oftentimes will use this when I'm braiding my, um, braiding my hair down for crochets just to make sure that I have extra, you know, moisture and hydration in my hair. So absolutely love this. And it's not too expensive. I think these are like $5 on Amazon. Next is a water spray bottle. Now, this is the old one. I cannot find the one that I like to use. The one that I like to use has like a continuous sprayer. Um, so the one that I'm showing on Amazon absolutely is the one that I love. Um, this is not the one. You know the ones with the like um, continuous sprayer. I can't remember what you call them, but um definitely a grab you one of these a water bottle is a must when you are styling your hair so you know detangling making your hair more manageable this is so important a lot of times if i want to detangle my hair i'll mix water and conditioner in this bottle and make sure that i'm getting um my hair detangled um using th this water bottle and um, conditioner mixed in it i just mix it shake it up spray the conditioner and water mix on my hair to detangle my hair so i'm not ripping and pulling my hair out love it for that and then i also use it when i'm braiding the kids hair just for re-wetting um i like to braid on hair that is somewhat damp i just find that it's easier for me to manipulate the hair get cleaner parts all of that so i definitely use this for re-wetting when i'm braiding the kids hair and my own hair too when i'm braiding my own hair as well 
Um, next product is the Evan Wonder Lace Bond. Love this stuff to death. Um, I think I have this on like automatic replenish every four months or so because I just use the mess out of this. Um, I haven't found a replacement for this as yet. I just really, really love this one because I can put use this for my lace adhesive when I only want to wear my wig for the day. And I typically only wear my wigs for the day. I usually always take my wigs off at night. I like to check on my hair and make sure my hair is doing good. So um, I love a adhesive spray that is easy for me to remove at night. So this is the one. Um, right now, this one is on sale for $8. Normally, it's closer to $10. So highly recommend this one if you like to wear your wigs for the day. And typically, what I do is just spray the first one. I'll grab my, I don't even know where it is right now. Oh, I'll grab my little fan. This is a fan. Let it, um, fan it, air it down, and then spray one more layer. Fan it, air it down. And once it's like nice and tacky, I go ahead and apply the wig. And that's all I need. Next, I don't have my bottles because my bottles are empty. But the Monday Hair Care Moisturizer, um, Conditioner and Shampoo love monday which you prefer black evan or red red black one for sure black definitely not the red so the question was which do i prefer the red one or the black one i definitely prefer the red evan lace spray okay because i find that this one holds good and it is easy to remove after a day of wear um monday hair care um shampoo and conditioner is upstairs in my shower right now i forgot to bring it down i did just realize i didn't bring it down but it's pretty much empty um this is not something that i have on replenishment for amazon but i'm realizing now i need to have that on a monthly replenishment from amazon because the monday hair care shampoo and conditioner is amazing i saw a lot of um reviews on it and i saw a lot of ads on it and i was like mm, is this worth the hype but I ordered it and got it and yeah, it's really good. And even for, you know, black girl hair, it does work. It does a great job. It keeps my hair moisturized and feeling great. So highly recommend the Monday shampoo and conditioner um, from Amazon. And like I said, I'm definitely going to start getting that on replenishment as well. The Pie Shoe Sublime Hold Hairspray. This is the large one. Um, the one that I have on Amazon is $14. I believe this one is $28. But I've had this one for two years and it's almost empty. It's, it's probably to about here. I love using this when I'm styling my hair because it is a light. It's a sublime hold. It's called sublime hold, but it's a flexible hold. So it's not going to make your hair hard or crunchy, but it is going to hold your curls, your um, crimps, whatever it is that you're doing, your braid out with your hair. It's going to give you that hold, but it's still going to have movement. It's still going to have body. And I love that about this hairspray. So this is the hairspray that I use like for styling my hair. I know a lot of people don't like hairspray because it makes the hair hard or it makes the hair crunchy or dries the hair out and the hair texture doesn't feel good after. This is not like that. This is hydrating to your hair, but at the same time gives it that flexible hold that I love when I'm styling my hair. So I use this like crazy. And like I said, this is the huge one, but I only have about this much left. So I'm definitely gonna be buying another one. And this is available on Amazon. And I, the reason why I like Pai Shu, it doesn't say on here, but Pai Shu is like a herbal um, based company. So all of their products are like based in herbs. And I like that. So next, oh, I didn't um, pull those out. Let me pull these out. Again, a lot of times I'll use this and I'll use Pai Shu. These are curling rods. They're like little small flexi curlers that you can use on your hair you just roll your hair into it you know close the flexi onto it and you can sleep in these overnight they're soft they have a spongy inside so it's like a sponge roller inside 
and then it has like a wire piece that allows you to fold it back onto itself so that you can roll your hair and curl your hair overnight um add a little bit of you know holding spray and the next day you have some really pretty curls but you can use these soft rollers and they're really comfortable and you know easy to use so i absolutely love those especially when i'm styling my hair for youtube videos next oh speaking of blow dry so when you're blow drying your hair it's important to have blow drying products that are amazing and i know what's coming next so i'm gonna just show it to you now the chi and the bio silk these two together okay these two together are insane love these can the rollers be used on natural hair? Absolutely. I use them on my short natural hair and they work amazing. My hair, my natural hair is to about here. It works amazing. It gives you more of a, how do I describe what it gives you? It gives you more of like a soft wave look, almost like a beach wave. So it's not going to give you a hard curl. If you want a hard curl, you're going to have to go in with your curling iron or your wand curler, curl it spray your holding spray and then roll the roller in and then that's going to give you like a real curl um if you want a beachy soft wave then you can skip the heat and just do a heatless and it's going to give you more of a softer look but if you want a harder curl i would go in with the curling iron but some naturals don't like to apply any heat the most heat that they'll do is maybe like a blow dry or not even a blow dry so yeah if you're not going to apply heat it's going to give you a softer more beachy look so these two okay this is the holy grail if your silk press is not coming out silked it's coming out like not bouncy and not soft and not like flowy it's coming out a little stiffer and less one you may need a trim because your split ends will not do as well um but two you're probably not using these two products <laughs> you need a good heat protectant before you go in even with your blow dryer you need a good heat protectant and that is this cheap 44 iron guard paraben free thermal protection spray okay this is basically empty so go ham do not splurt do not um you know go light on this go ham on this because this is going to protect your hair then you're going to want the silkening serum the only way to have a good silk press is to have a good silk serum if your silk serum is not good your silk press will come out stiff every single time this is the best. It's expensive as I don't know what. Okay, this is like $25. And this one is like $14. So together, these two products about to run you almost $40. Okay? Yes, you're going to spend that on this because I'm telling you, if you do that and you get this yellow bird blow dryer, your silk press is about to go down, okay? You just going to be bouncing and behaving and just feeling yourself like crazy because your silk press is going to be fire. So if, if nothing else in this video you hear from me, if you want a bomb silk press, I promise you this chi, this bio silk, and that yellow bird blow jar, I don't even care what flat iron you use. I use the baby list, but I don't even care if you use the baby list. You don't even have to use the baby list. You can use any flat iron and it will come out fire. Now, you want it to come out even more fire, add the shampoo and conditioner because having a good shampoo and conditioner also makes a big difference, okay? Um, if you don't start off with a good shampoo and conditioner, that will also affect your silk press, okay? Okay. Um, if you want to see how my silk press come out using all these products together, go on my Instagram. My Instagram is Jess, uh, Jess Fly Finds. I have several um, silk press blowout videos on there where you can see my natural hair. I, fly, I use a lot of heat on my hair, but my hair is still healthy. It still grows. It still you know, does well, it still silks out nicely, and I still retain my length because I use 
products that aren't cheap. You know, I don't I don't like to use cheap products on my hair, on my natural hair, on my wigs, honey. Um, give me a two dollar product in a minute, okay? I will do that on my wigs, but on my natural hair, I like to use quality and I like to use things that I know work. These are tried and true, tested products that definitely work. So I highly recommend these, and these are available on Amazon. Again, this one is twenty five maybe $26. And this one, I think you can find it on sale, but for the most part, this one is about $14. Now these two, I think you can also find these in Marshalls. Not 100% sure on that, but I know people have told me they have found these in Marshalls. So take your pick. You could potentially get them at Marshalls. I just get mine on Amazon because I get everything on Amazon and it's just easier for me. Um, Next, my favorite brush. This is my favorite detangling brush, and it's also my favorite um, curl, juicy curl, get your juicy curls popping brush. This will have your curls super popping um, for your curly wigs. Like if you have a deep wave wig, a tropical deep wave, a paradise curl, like a curly wig, a deep curl. Um, these are going, this um, kinky curly, juicy curly wigs. This is going to get your curls super, super popping. You know how people's curls just like look really juicy and luscious on those type of units or even your own natural hair. If your hair is natural, like I use this on my daughter's hair and it just be popping. The curls be everywhere. So highly recommend this. Of course, you need to have a good mousse and you need to have a good leave-in conditioner if you want your curls to pop. Um, the ones that I recommend, I recommend the Glee Made um, Styling Mousse. And I also recommend the leave-in conditioner is from Shea Moisture. So I um, love those and love this brush. This brush is very affordable as well. I believe it's like $6. Um, and you can use it on your natural hair and on your curly wigs. You can use it to detangle your hair as well. And it's very gentle. It's very, very gentle. So love this brush. Holy Grail item, I love, um, highly, highly recommend. I use it for every braid style, every crochet style, every um, cornrow style. I use it on every single person in my household from the babies on up all the way to me, to my mother. So um, highly, highly recommend the Shining Jam. It doesn't create a lot of buildup. It doesn't get, um, you know, super gunky. It's easy to work with. Um, it makes the hair slip, but it also makes it like it makes the hair slip while you're braiding, but it also makes the hair hold once the braid is complete. So um, it just gives you a nice clean finish and it's very easy to work with. Love the Shining Jam. Um, my, my containers of Shining Jam are always almost empty um, and I always have a new one in the stash um as a backup because it's just that great of a product i never run out of this product when once it starts to get low i go ahead and drop that that 13 dollars 11 dollars well worth it you can buy this in your local beauty supply store you can buy this for i think 13 dollars on amazon it's 11 so highly recommend grabbing this on amazon um I promise you, once you start using it, you will see why everybody raves about it. It's amazing. And a black woman formulated this for Shine and Jam. Shine and Jam is not black owned, I don't believe, but I do believe it is black run. And this one was designed by a black woman, Stasha Harris. She is a beast at braiding and doing locks. Also consider following her page for braid inspo. Um, a lot of times I'm not super inspired in terms of braiding men's hair but i do have a young boy and i do have you know um middle school age boys that are growing their hair out and i do try to get inspired as to how to style their hair i'm pretty good at styling the the baby girl and my my um older daughter hair and styling my own braids because i've been styling women's braids my whole life but sometimes you need some inspo um even even for the girls you need some inspo so stasha um, is just extremely creative and gifted with her fingers. So obviously that's why she's called Magic Fingers. So definitely follow her for inspiration as well. And next, oh, I just showed you guys this. Love this if you want to get those juicy curls. Um, Glee Made Styling Mousse is the way to go. We do have the regular formula and the soft hold. Love the soft hold formula as well. That is great for making your curls pop, okay? 
Um, next, Glee Made Edge Control. Love, love, love this. Um, the This is coming out in a black container as well now. Um, love the Glee Made Edge Control. I will show you guys how it works. Literally just grab some edge control. I didn't even do my edges today. But literally just grab some. You can use both sides of the little edge brush. And again, that set that I showed you um, with the Snatch Your Brain brush, it comes with the edge brush as well. So if you grab that, you will have your edge control brush as well in that little set. So you see, you don't need a lot of product and you don't need a lot of skill in order to just lay you know, your baby hair is really easily with this Glee Made Edge Control. Now, the reason why I have two different edge controls, they do two different things. This is for braiding. Okay, I would not use this on my edges, not never. This is for your edges. You can use it with braiding, but I would never use it for like a whole entire braid style. Um, I would use the Stasha. This is more for your edges and your baby hairs. And then... Um, I would add a little bit of hairspray on top, put my edge scarf on, and this will be laid. This will be absolutely laid. So love the Glee Made Edge Control. Obviously, I love it. It's my brand. It is available on Amazon as well as on my website, GleeMade.com. And next, oh, stuff is just like piling up. Let me see. What is next? Oh, Glee Mate Wax Stick, another great product that works amazing on slicking your ponytails. Um, I told you this brush I love to use for slicking my ponytails. This, this is the one I was talking about, the one that's, you know, um, snatch your brain, brush your brain away brush. Um, and so for also for slicking ponytails back, I love the wax stick. It just grabs all those flyaway hairs um, and doesn't do too much um product you can easily just use that and it slicks up and once you add your hairspray it gives you that nice slick look i like to use it usually on top of gel and it slicks it really really good but i don't have any gel in my hair i didn't use any gel but you can already kind of see the difference the flyaways on this side from the flyaways on this side. It really does lay the hair down. So, and I don't even have any gel on my hair. If I had some gel and some hairspray, it would definitely be bomb. So check out the Glee Made Wax Stick. Um, if you've never worked with a wax stick, you got four kids. No, I have five. Wow. <laughs> yes. Yes, honey. Yes. Yes, yes. Um, I like to, I do a lot of juicing. I do a lot of cooking at home. I, I eat a lot of my own food. Um, with that many kids, you don't eat out a lot. <laughs> Even McDonald's is expensive when you're buying for seven people. So yeah, we have a household of seven, honey. Yes, ma'am. So I do a lot of cooking. We, we eat a lot of curry chicken, a lot of rice, fried rice. Every meal we pretty much eat is with rice and pasta. But um, a lot of times I will kind of like um, in the morning, I tend to do like smoothies and juice juicing. Um, so you'll see even on my Instagram, I do a lot of like juice um, recipes and smoothie recipes. My Beast Blender is my favorite and my Omega Juicer is also my favorite. I absolutely love them. So um, I do a lot of juicing in the morning. Um, I'm trying to steer clear of coffee as much as possible, but yeah. But I tend to eat more like in the evenings and at night. In the morning, I, I tend not to eat a lot because I have a lot of running around to do. I'm dropping kids to daycare. I'm dropping kids to high school. Like um, our oldest is about to be in high school. So she's in this um, high school readiness program. So we're kind of just like running the boys. The middle boys are in camp. So in the mornings, I'm kind of just running. So I like to drink my breakfast in the morning, um, either smoothies or juices or something like that. 
And then as soon as I get back, I try to create content. Um, so again, I don't want to stop and like eat a plate of food. So the most that I'm eating is more in the evenings. But yes, honey, if you guys want to know more about like my juices and my smoothies, I do have them on my Instagram, but I want to start doing more long form content showing you guys like the juices and smoothies that I make um, on a daily basis. All right, so next we have some uh, press on nails. I love press on nails. If you guys follow me, follow me on Instagram, on my social media, I love, love press on nails. So here are a couple of press ons that I found this month. I still haven't tried them yet, but I'm sharing them with you guys before I try them. So this is like an ombre one. It's white at the top and natural. These are the toenail press ons. Love these. Yes, yes, yes. I will I will be sharing those tips and no problem, Ray. So these are um some press on toenails. Totally obsessed with these are seven dollars on Amazon. These next ones have hearts on them. It's like a French French with a line across and they have hearts on them. I cannot wait to try these. Make sure you're following me on Jess Fly Finds because I'll be showing all of these on there. Um, the next ones are these pink and yellow ones. I posted those on my Instagram and they just went dumb. Like everybody loved those pink and yellow nails. So um, definitely grab those. Those are fire and they're $7 on Amazon. Um, these tweezers, where, where are my tweezers? Because people always ask me in my nail videos what I'm using to apply my nails. And it is literally these. It's these little pink tweezers. I use them to grab the toenails because, you know, the small toenails are really, really tiny. Like, like if you see how tiny these are, it's hard to grab them with your finger. So I grab them with the I grab them with the tweezer and it's easier for me to apply the press on with the tweezer. And people always ask me, what is, what is that you're using? What is that? I'm like, it's a tweezer. It's just a straight tweezer. So definitely grab the tweezer. Um, it will help. Um, the next toenails are the ones I just showed. These are $6 on Amazon toenail press ones. I'm definitely going to be trying all these before the week is out. Before the week is out. Before the month is out. So I can show you guys how all these press on toenails look and the last one have glitter at the top and fade down into a neutral a nude color definitely um going to try these because i want to share with you guys how these toenail press ons will come out next is the makeup eraser i absolutely love the makeup eraser it's upstairs i forgot to bring it downstairs um unfortunately but it's just like a cloth that removes your makeup so instead of you having to use like baby wipes or face wipes all you have to do is run the makeup eraser cloth underneath your um sink and you can just remove all your makeup in one swipe and you don't have to go through you know cleansers and body um and um facial uh you know scrubs and washes and all of that it just takes all the makeup off and then you just throw it in the washing machine and i love that because it's reusable it's better for the environment and i don't have to use wipes or anything to clean makeup off of my face next as i said before i have a family of seven there is seven of us so this um a variety pack of dove for 33 dollars is a huge saving for me. When I found this on Amazon, I added this to my monthly, um, not monthly, I think I do it um, every six weeks, um, where I replenish our soap for the month. Um, we have three bathrooms and we have, like I said, seven people in this house. So we go through a lot of body wash. <laughs> and usually one of these is like $6. Um, so you think about six of these for $33. I love it. And it's a variety pack. So everybody in the family can have one that they like, um, and have, you know, a couple extra stashed under their sink in their shower bathroom. And, um, I just love grabbing these off of Amazon and the fact that it just comes without me having to think about it. Um, and I never run out of body wash for the family and everyone always has one that they like. So I have this on replenishment and I'm so grateful for it because 
$33 for six Dove body washes is an amazing price. Not to mention, this stuff is heavy. Like when you go to Target or you go to the grocery store and you're buying milk, juice, groceries for seven people and you're lugging juices and orange juice and rice and potatoes in the house, it's just, it's heavy. Um, so I love the fact that it can be delivered. I just asked one of the boys, run downstairs, grab the Amazon package, and, you know, the soap is here. It just arrives, and I don't have to go to the grocery store lugging around, you know, six bottles of Dove. <laughs> um, not to mention the price is amazing. It's way better than what I'll find in the grocery store or Target. So love that. And next are my favorite lip glosses, affordable lip glosses. They're literally very very affordable on amazon these are the nyx butter glosses and you can get these i think they're like 3.99 on amazon or you can get the multi-pack for for like 15 dollars or 14 dollars something like that um love these butter glosses i have so many different colors of them all the different shades of browns in them and tans i love so today i think i'm wearing i don't think i'm wearing the butter gloss today i think i'm wearing the milky gloss yeah i'm wearing the milky gloss um, but again, all of these are fire. Um, which ones do I have? I have Spike Coffee, Ginger Snap, Brownie Drip. This one is Brownie Drip. This one is Ginger Snap. Spiked Coffee. And these are all like the black girl ones you definitely need. Fortune Cookie and Cranberry Pie. So, absolutely love those. I feel like I have more, but my daughter likes to snatch those um, and thinks she doesn't need to return them. So, yeah, there's that. <laughs> and some of them are, like, in my purses and stuff because um, I just I just keep them on hand. And then the next one, these are $8 each. They're a little bit more because I think you get more in the container. And the formula is different. These are milky. So, I'm wearing this one today, this milky one. And this is in shade Salted Caramel. It comes out really light. But it blends down not as light. So definitely love the Milky one. Again, it gives you more of that like creamy look. And it's very hydrating, but all of them are very hydrating. The butter gloss is very hydrating as well. Absolutely adore these glosses. Highly recommend NYX, obviously. All of their glosses and lip products are bomb. So definitely recommend those. As for the underlayer today, I am wearing my Ruby Kisses. Another one that I swear by and buy over and over again. As you can see, this one is empty. So I have the replacement already ready for it. Um, I've been using these ever since 2000. My daughter was born in 2009. I've probably been using these ever since 2010. Um, I found these in the beauty supply store. Um, and that's where I first found them. But now they're on Amazon. You can get them for $4.00. Guys, it's the best deal you are going to find for a, these are forever matte. This is a matte liquid lipstick for $4. And they are fire. Like the shades of these, this one is called Choco Craze. No, this one is called Oh Boy. Look at how rich that is. I use it for a lip liner. On the outside of my lips this is choco craze um but as you can see i've used it all the way down this one is i'm chic again i have so many of these this is i'm chic a nice like pillowy creamy shade that's almost skin tone but almost like with a grayish cast love it this one is dune this one is going to be your really light 
beige shade. But imagine all three of these together. Like this one as the liner, this one as the base, and this one as the center in the middle of the lip. Guys, highly recommend. I can't even tell you how many of these I have because they're four stinking dollars. Like, okay, here, here, here's, here's my collection. I'm about to show y'all. It's going to be embarrassing. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. This one's empty. This one's completely empty. Like, it just goes to show you, like, how I've crushed. This is empty. It's gone. Um, So, highly recommend this. This is a product that I stand by. And this is by Ruby Kisses. A very unassuming brand, but at the same time has been consistently serving with these lipsticks for years okay for years love those so swear by that four dollar product for sure um next the lip bar another one i swear by owned by a black woman so you really can't go wrong she has everything from liquid lipsticks matte lipsticks um which i have so many different shades this is hot mama rich auntie boss lady Game Changer, so many, um, and a couple of them are in my purses, but highly recommend these guys. Um, these obviously owned by a black woman, so I'm going to support, but the lip bar not only um, has great products, great assortment as well, and um, their lip glosses are also bomb. Shayna B., I've talked about them on my on my page before. Um, Shayna B is a brush company. They make the best, most beautiful brushes that just last. Okay, this is the Shayna B Kabuki brush. I use this for my foundation today. The powder brush. This is one of my oldest brushes. I've had this brush. Why do I gauge everything based off of my daughter's age? My daughter was born in 09, so I must have had this like two years after she was born. So maybe I've had this since 2011. Still popping. Wash them, air dry them. They still work and just, just do an amazing job. So if you've not tried Shayna B, she's not cheap. Her brushes are not cheap, but worth the investment if you do makeup or want to get into makeup. You know, I would suggest just try... The first two, the main two that I would suggest um, is, is going to be between these three, actually. These are the main three. The contour brush, which is for your contour, um, you know, around the outside of your face. And the angle of this brush is really important. The powder brush, which is going to be full face of powder. And then your kabuki brush, which is your foundation. So I would definitely say start with one of those three um, and see how that works out for you because I absolutely love Shayna B. Um, next, a tried and true Sasha, Sasha Buttercup. You can't go wrong with Sasha Buttercup. It's like been using this ever since I started makeup, ever since this got popping. I use it in the color Buttercup. They have several other colors. Um, but this, I feel like, is the quintessential shade that works well for so many skin tones. Um, love Buttercup. It sets the um, under eye and just makes you look nice and bright and awake, but not giving that cast of ghostly in pictures or as the day progresses. Y'all already know Sasha Buttercup. I just can't come on here and not talk about that. Um, I'm excited about these, these finger press-ons. Um, they're super bright, hot pink. And with the Barbie moving coming up, I mean, who doesn't need a pair of pink Barbie nails? So I just thought these were so cute. They're not too, too long, but very, very cute. And I want to wear them to the Barbie premiere. <laughs> Are y'all going to go see the Barbie movie? I hope it's worth the hype because the way people have been hyping Barbie, if I see another Hey Barbie clothing haul, Hey Barbie, Hey Barbie, I'm just like, y'all. 
<laughs> do we need more Barbie content? And then I'm like, but no, I'm going to do these nails tomorrow and I'm going to post my Barbie content and I'm going to be on my Hey Barbie too. But I'm just saying. Um, Next. Oh, beads. If you guys have girls, um, I'm always on the search for beads on Amazon. I don't know if you guys are as well. But I have girls and they love beads and I love doing their hair and making them really cute because my daughters are cute and I love them. <laughs> and I know I'm biased, but hey, is what it is. Look at these colors. These are such cute colors. Now, these beads are large and so that's the only thing. So make sure you put them on an older girl because they are large but look at these colors like sometimes it's hard to find like nice bright i feel like my finger is like covering it nice bright colorful beads like sometimes they're like muted and not cute but these are cute sasha buttercup is definitely an oldie but goodie you already know what time it is um but yeah i just thought these beads were absolutely adorable the colors are popping and yeah seven dollars on amazon now i know a lot of people are looking like seven dollars for a pack of beads i can get them for two dollars at the beauty supply yes you can but at the beauty supply you're only going to get like 20 beads for two dollars so let's let's think here you get 160 beads in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight different colors. You know in the beauty supply store, it's only three colors in a pack and it's only 20 beads. So you can get a pink pack and then you have to get a clear pack and then you have to get a white pack and then you have to get a glitter pack. So you're already at one, two, three, you're already at $8, okay? You could be at $7 and get all these different colors of beads for $7. And you're going to get 160 beads. So, I mean, the math is definitely mathing on that. And then if you want some pastel ones, they have the pastel pack as well. Which you can't go wrong with a pastel pack of beads as well. Again, $7. But again, these are a little bit larger. Okay. So, just know that these are a little larger. Um, so if you have a, a young baby girl, I probably wouldn't put these larger ones on a young baby girl. Um, I know they're really like hard to see, but I'm trying to show them. But the colors are very, very pretty and vibrant. And they're not ones that I typically see in the beauty supply. That's why when I saw them online, I was like, ooh, those are popping. And those are not colors that I'm used to seeing at the beauty supply store. Like these colors are very vibrant and pretty um but the beads are a little bit big so i am still on the hunt for beads that are the right size for the younger baby but these ones are good for my older daughter next i love these i know it's summertime and we're not wearing dark nails but these navy blue nails just caught my eye because they were just really giving and I don't wear dark colored nails typically, but it was just something about these. I was like, ooh, it's grown, it's sexy, they're long, they're bedazzled, they have rhinestones everywhere, and they're dark navy blue. Like, wow, I had to get it. So next, I got influenced, you guys. Influencer girls got me. I bought the silicone sponges, okay? And again, household of seven. So the three pack was the way to go. I got the three pack. This is what the colors look like on the package. This is what they look like in real life. So it's giving, it's giving, yes, true to the package, true to the size. And like, yes, I love when Amazon advertises exactly what you're going to get. Look at the package. Look at the product. Same exact product. And I'm happy. Um, this was a test. For my family, I got one for everybody. Of course, um, the girls love them. The guys are like, eh, take it or leave it. So I think I'll be returning the colors that I got for the guys. I think the, the three pack that I got for the guys was like black, gray, and blue. This is the pack I got for the girls and the babies. So the babies love them, actually. And the great thing about them is they're soft enough for babies. 
They're silicone. They're extremely, extremely soft. Like, you see how soft they are? Um, they just feel good. Um, and what I like about them is they're not a sponge and they're not a washcloth. So they're not holding like dead skin cells. They're not holding excess soap in them um, that can get mildewed. They're not holding anything. Like you wash them and they're clean after you wash your body. And that's what I really like about these. Um, I also like that you can use less soap with these because the product just goes in and goes directly onto your body instead of getting soaked in or lost inside of a cleansing poof or inside of a washcloth. I feel like you end up using a lot of product. Again, we have seven people. We use a lot of soap and a lot of body wash. So anything I can do to stretch the body wash, I'm going to do. <laughs> so I feel like these help. Um, so yeah, I love these, uh, $11.99 for a three pack. You buy two and then I bought myself one, seven people. Everybody has one done. Next are these silicone, um, uh, silicone are these vinyl disposable gloves. I love these for so many different things. When I'm packing packages for sending out wigs, I use them. Cause I don't want to, you know, just be handling people's hair and wigs and hair care products. So I use them when I'm packing packages. I also use them when I'm cooking in the kitchen and I'm cooking with meat. Um, a lot of times I have my press ons on and I don't want to touch the meat with my nails or sometimes I just don't want to touch the meat at all in general. Like I just want to put on some gloves and cook, um, you know, season my meat real good with my gloves on. So I'll, I usually have like a pack of these gloves where I'm packing my wigs. And then I also have a pack of these gloves wherever I am in the kitchen. And I love them. Like even the boys, they love to cook with me, but sometimes they don't want to touch it either. So these are great, um, affordable. They're $7 for like a hundred, uh, how many? 50 yeah, they're $7 for 50. It'll take forever to go through this pack, even using it with me and the boys. Like we were cooking chicken fingers the other day. And you know, when you cook chicken fingers, there's like so many steps and it just builds up on your fingers. You gotta, you know, clean the chicken first. Then you gotta, you know, put the chicken in the milk wash. Then you put it in the flour. Then you put it in the egg wash. Then you put it in the bread, um, in the bread crumbs. So it just gets it gets to be a lot. So I think um, my son really enjoyed doing it with the gloves this time. And when I was making the curry, I used the gloves too. And it was I, it's just a much more enjoyable experience when you can just, you know, do everything you need to do with the meat, pop these gloves off, and you're done. So yeah, I love these gloves. I love the fact that they're pink. Maybe that has to do with Barbie too. Like, I don't know, but I've had these for way longer than the Barbie movie. <laughs> All right. And another product I absolutely love, skincare um, nourishment in our home. We use Cetaphil moisturizing cream. And I love getting this cream on Amazon because you can literally save like $6. This container at the Walmart, I believe is $20. Um, now mind you, this is the 20 ounce and I know Amazon is giving it for $13 and it's the 16 ounce, but still you can get the 16 ounce for $13. Um, I think even the 16 ounce at Walmart is like 17. So I would highly, highly recommend trying this out. If you do get it from Walmart the first time, fine. But if you try it out and your family loves it, like mine does, um, I would say, you know, switch and grab it on Amazon because you are going to get a deal. It's a nice, thick cream, and I really use it as an alternative to, um, I use it as an alternative to, um, why, why am I blanking? It's not Aquaphor. Eucerin. I use it as an alternative for Eucerin. Eucerin can be a little greasy. It can be a little too dense. It's like 
harder to maneuver and work with and I feel like it can be more uncomfortable on younger babies and younger children even even the the older children like they just don't want to use it all the time um because it it, it, it doesn't spread as well it just doesn't it, it's not as convenient to work with this stuff is amazing it feels amazing on the skin it spreads well it lotions in easily and quickly um and it keeps you moisturized and hydrated it's a nice consistency it feels good on it doesn't have a huge amount of scent um, it doesn't irritate the skin. It makes the skin feel really, really good. And everyone that I have talked to about this that has given it a try, that has anything from like dry to eczema prone skin, or, you know, if your babies get a lot of heat rash or, you know, your babies just have things going on, or even your, um, you know, older children have things going on with their skin or their skin just tends to get dry or have dry patches. I promise you, this is a great alternative to Eucerin or Aqua it's not greasy and it feels really good on the skin it just is it's, it feels really good on the skin um, we go through bottles of these monthly and again that that once a month once every six week replenishment from Amazon it really is a great thing for things that you just can't run out of and you want to make sure that your family just does not run out of and this is one of those items so definitely definitely I know people love Cetaphil for their skincare and their moisture their um, moisturizing um, cleanser but I love Cetaphil for this product here and this is the one of the few. I also use Cetaphil um, moisturizing lotion, but this is like the liquid one. Um, these are the two products that I love, love, love from Cetaphil. I haven't tried the face wash, so I don't know, but absolutely love those. Also, if you have eczema prone skin, you definitely always want to have cortisone around. Um, cortisone is amazing, and it's not just for eczema, like. We don't have eczema in this house. Nobody in this house has eczema. Um, but we do have dry skin and we do have skin irritation things that we do deal with. Um, like sometimes my daughter has dry patches in her scalp when I'm braiding her hair. And if I see something like that, I'm not necessarily going to put grease on that. Like that's not something necessarily that gr grease is great for moisturizing the hair follicles in the scalp. But when I see patches and things, you know, like um, bumps or any little rash or any little heat rash, that's where cortisone comes in. And I do not use cortisone cream. I only use cortisone ointment. The cream to me does not work and it's a waste of money. Um, there's too much water in it or there's not enough medication in it. I don't know what it is, but cortisone cream does not work. Um, if I'm going to spend my money on the cortisone, it has to be the ointment because the cream does not work. And I, I just, I don't know why, but it doesn't. So the difference between the ointment, obviously this, what I just showed you is cream. This is ointment. Ointment is oil based. Okay. Ointment is translucent. You can see through it. It is not white and it is, it is oil based. Okay, so I always, always, always buy the ointment. Now, this is what you have. You have to purchase this one on Amazon. You cannot find this in a store. There is no store. I promise you in the whole of DC, we search for probably two days for ointment and all they sell is cream. All different types of cream, all different types of sprays, all different types of cortisone creams. If you want the ointment, you got to get it online and it's eight dollars. Sorry, you just got to do it. But I promise you, any any irritation in the scalp, any irritation, heat rash, any irritation of dry patches or anything like that, cortisone knock it out. Two days of putting it on there, cortisone knocks it out. So we keep cortisone in the house. And this is something that we just refuse to run out of. And if you have any of those type of things going on in your home, highly recommend it. Another tried and true old school favorite been using this ever since my mother was doing my hair when I was a child. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm pulling out the old school favorites, y'all. 
Um, some, some of these things is going to take you all the way back to when your mama was doing your hair when you was a little girl. But I promise you, they still, they still work. Like, they still work. Pink oil still works. I use it on my children to this day. Every child whose hair that I braid or do, they mama bring them over here. I'm putting this in their hair. I'm putting this in their hair. I'm putting this in their hair. I'm putting that grease in their hair every time. And I'm putting some beads on the little girl's hair. It just period. It, it's happening. You bring your child over here. I'm, I'm putting these items in their hair. And they're going to leave out of here with some beads. Point blank period. It just, it just is what it is. I don't know. Don't bring them over here for me to do their hair then. Because <laughs> it's happening. It's happening. <laughs> Next. Another favorite. This Dove. Um, who told me about this? Kita. I think my homegirl Kita told me about this. And she gave me a little tester one, a little travel size one. Honey, I've been hooked ever since. This stuff holds you down. Okay, holds you down. It keeps you fresh and um, it works well. Now, my daughter says sometimes it can irritate her, maybe because it's in an aerosol can. I love it, that the fact that it's in an aerosol can. And it never irritates me at all. So, you give it a try. You tell me what you think. But I love, love, love this deodorant. I don't buy any other deodorant anymore. And that is the end. That is all the products. Whew, that was enough, right? That was a lot of products. But I wanted to share with you guys all of my Amazon faves um in the beauty category i'm gonna start trying to do this um like once every two to three days share with you guys the things that i found on amazon some of them will be things that i've tried already some of them will be things that i want to try like these nails i haven't tried these yet but i want to try them so i will definitely let you guys know a lot of these products are things that i absolutely love and have used for years if you want links to these products definitely definitely head over to amazon and uh or actually i'll put the links in here on instagram and youtube i'll put the links in the comments and in the description box thank you maria um in the description box and in the comments but for now um everybody on amazon thank you so much for watching my first live ever i have never gone live on amazon before but i wanted to try it out and see you know what it was all about and i appreciate you guys for tuning in and watching make sure you guys follow me on amazon um so you don't miss any new lives or anything that i add to my amazon storefront and all right you guys thank you so much so so much for spending your evening with me it's 9 30 you guys were in it for the long haul and i appreciate it i will see you guys in the next one peace